So technically zero trust is a framework, but for me, it's a mindset. It's a way of looking at cybersecurity. Fundamentally, it's the principle of least privilege. So just because something can run doesn't mean it needs to be able to run. Just because something can access the entire internet doesn't mean it needs to be able to access the entire internet. And just because something can access your files and your data doesn't mean it needs to be able to access your files and your data. So what that means is block by default, allow by exception. Okay, so if you think about your traditional model, your traditional approach to cybersecurity, it's to permit by default and block by exception. So allow everything to run unless we know it to be bad. What Zero Trust means and what Threat Locker does is to block by default, allow by exception. So block everything from running except those things that need to run in your environment. Block everything from happening except those things that need to happen in your environment. So it's a mind shift change to your traditional approach, but it's extremely effective from a cybersecurity perspective.